Hey, single moms, would you like to be able to bring your dream life into being? And just think about it. What would it mean to you? And what would that life look like for you? You know, just try to picture that and make it as vivid as you can in your mind and add as many details as possible to that picture because that's going to make it so much more real. And today we are talking to our guest about exactly how you can do that. So I am awesome, Angie Ingstrom. And I'm Girard Gard. And we are so thrilled to have you here with us today. Aparajita, did I, did I say correct? Yes. Hello, everyone. Oh. How are you all? <laughs> and yeah, we are excited to have you here because we know you're going to bring uh, our audience so much value. So we're, we're really happy you agreed to, to, to be with us today. And uh, honestly, I can't wait to, to share your message. But before we, we start doing that, I wanted to do a short bio um, because maybe not all our listeners know you already. So um, I hope that's okay. That's fine. Now, great. <laughs> now, I've heard Jita. She's a transformational coach and uh, she has so many years uh, of experience in working in helping single moms and divorced women create a life that they love in spite of the circumstances they may being and I, I i i honestly i love this message i think it's a positive so i'm really looking forward to 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 hear what you have to share with us today welcome sure yeah okay. all right i'm very well, excited to be here excellent so welcome to momentum makers podcast and um so we're just going to jump right into your story Aparajita. what what inspired you to get started in your business um as a single mom first i had to take care of uh, all the finances of household my children and myself um so i worked i worked in it but still it was i was getting um highly paid but it still it wasn't enough i wanted to do better for my children I wanted to give them the best possible life for them. Um, so I was thinking about earning and what is my passion, what I like to do. Um, bringing like joy, happiness uh, in people's life, that gave me joy. I saw that. And I provided like many, many years, many rather, rather say decades of services uh, towards people, helping them. And it just came to me that I, I can use this to help people and earn money at the same time. And then in 2014, I went to the coaching trainings, uh, got certified in a couple of them, um, and then work on my transformational on the side as well, read so many transformational books, followed so many processes. Um, since then, I started uh, coaching people. I started with the free sessions, then I started getting paid. And it just gave me joy and I cannot tell, express that, that when see people who I coach, I see the creation happening in their life is such a joy. It's, yeah. So that's what I like to do for people. And I see that like large, massive actions happen. It's like magic when I coach them, even just within three months, I mm -hmm. saw massive transformation in people's life and accidents started happening. That's and awesome. it's very thrilling, very thrilling. That's awesome. Yeah, amazing. Yeah. Yeah. I love that. Yeah. Go ahead, Katie. I've been, yeah, I've been doing this since 2014. And then I came across in 2020. In COVID, I, yeah, because the, uh, no, I didn't have a job uh, due to COVID. I saw uh, Christopher Michael Duncan's training on Facebook. And I took that training in 2020. And uh, for a year long, I took a test and got certified. Since then, I'm using magnetic mind processes and super conscious record for all my coaching. Okay. Wonderful. Go ahead, Lee. So. Yeah, I I just wanted to ask. So 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 do you have you developed some kind of process for how you help uh women create the life they 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 really love? Uh, you just yes. yeah yeah. I, I I was thinking about your own background because you you have you've actually been one of these women. Mm -hmm. You've been their their shoes. So yeah, I really like that. 
Yeah, I use the record process and other magnetic mind processes, uh, which I learned from my last coaching training, uh, using the superconscious and intuition, your own intuition. Um, it's like most importantly, I learn about record uh, connecting to the superconscious and record processes, like most profound uh, uh, training I have learned till now. Uh, it helps to transform and uh, create like uh, results you want, life you want in your life, like very with ease and flow. And it's, um, you can see that it's just in few minutes, you can see the transformation and shifts happening in your life, releasing all like past programming and phobias, uh, self-conscious and un unconscious um, thinking pattern. I have seen that in my life and all those who I help. Uh, so for super conscious record, we I use uh, five steps. You choose uh, what do you want, what do you like to create, and to create that, we we'll connect to the results or your goal emotionally. We get into the emotion of the end result. Mm -hmm. And feel into it. We visualize it that you are living your end result to your true goal right now at this very moment. We connect to it. And then we come back to now and we see what is going on in your current reality right now at this moment in your life. And then mm -hmm. we create a structural tension and we'll, we'll look at the resistance, where it stands, what, what's in the way of the creation of your end results. It could be thoughts, beliefs, resistance, anything it could be. So we look at that. And from that point, we use the record process. And when I use the record process, I do this record command very silently. Um, may, and may, I, may I? So, yeah, sure. Sorry to interrupt. Um, it's just, um, I, I'm thinking that our listeners might not know what the, what the record process is. Mm -hmm. Could you speak to that? Uh, yes, super. it's uh, connecting to your own higher self. We use that. Mm -hmm. Record process is a process uh, to create what you love, which is um, like reprogramming your brain. It's like, uh, yeah. Yeah, when you, yeah, there is a coding in the computer. So same way uh, we reprogram our brain to create what we want in our life. Mm. But resistance is inevitable in everything that we do and mm -hmm. um, that recode process um, mm -hmm. that you do. It's very powerful for people that, yeah. yeah. And so tell me a little bit more about your story specifically. Did, are, did these processes make a big difference in your life? You mentioned it just kind of casually. Can we dig into that a little bit more? Yeah, sure. Um, the way I am now, I, when I joined back in July 2020, I wasn't like this. I was living like um, in a problem structure. Um, I had so many like self-doubts, unconscious thinking patterns. I got over it and I shifted that after using like many, many records processes on my own self. Mm -hmm. um, when I joined um, um, CC training, Magman training, I didn't have a job. Literally, I had a negative bank balance at that time in my life. and But I still joined the training. I took the money from the credit card. And soon after that, I got an uh, IT job um, and uh, worked from home. Uh, it, it was very high paying IT job and paid up all my debts. And as well as um, I created the like houses. I sold those houses before I came to Australia. I lived in US. I had very high paying IT job. I resigned from that job and I came here and I figured out everything on my own. So that is a huge thing. I, I rarely spoke. I rarely spoke. Now I'm speaking in front of you guys. Well, Angie awesome. knows that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I, I asked Yi to kind of help jump in a little bit on this yeah. interview more than she normally does. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> because... I am also a trained magnetic mind coach. And so I mm -hmm. understand the lingo you're saying, but mm -hmm. Gidi does not. She doesn't understand. So Gidi, can you kind of, is there anything else, any other clarifying questions that you would, that's in your mind right now? The one that came up for me, I already know the answer, but 
I'm thinking our listeners may not understand what the problem structure is. You mentioned problem structure. Can you explain yes. that? Yeah, problem structure is uh, usually when there is issue, we keep thinking about that. Whatever happened in the past, okay, I have this problem in this uh, in relationship, health, wealth. So we think about that rather than creating from where you are. That's called the you are in, in your problem structure rather than being in the creative structure means focusing on your creation, what you truly want to create in your life. I love that. Okay. The now, 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 Go ahead, yeah, yeah. Now, now, I was thinking because, Andrew, you mentioned magnetic coach, and I don't know what a magnetic coach is. So, so oh. could you clarify that? <laughs> I'll, I'll let a pair of Jita answer that. <laughs> Yeah, mm -hmm. magnetic point coach means uh, you are becoming a magnet to what you want to create in your life. Mm -hmm. okay. It's like magically create. Yeah, you become a magnet to create what you want in your life. And it just align action and outcomes results. It just happens. It truly happens. Like you become magnet. Yeah. Okay. Well, which tools do you use to do that? Is that something like affirmations or how do you do it? No, I, we don't use affirmation. I don't use okay. affirmation. No. It's just the different processes. We use different okay. processes. Uh, we uh, call it unpacking. Unpacking means uh, what is in your way, what is in the current reality, which is stopping you to where you want to be, what you mm -hmm. want to achieve in your life. So we dig okay. into that. Uh, it could be from anywhere, could be thinking pattern or past programming, anything. So we dig into that and re uh, reach at that original event or, or emotion, whatever is stopping you to get there. We unpack that and create what you want. And just to clarify too, it's not this you know, week long journey of digging and looking for all the problems. It's none of that. <laughs> It's, mm -hmm. it's very quick. It's instantaneous. Yeah. Like there's, it's a fast yeah. process because with that problem structure, um, you know, it's, you're focusing on the problem rather than creating what you want. <laughs> mm -hmm. And, 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 and it's uh, all humans on this planet yeah. are like that where like you just, we're, we're humans. We can't get away from that. We're just yeah. kind of focused yeah. on, Oh, we got to fix this. And, but rather than just a little, these little nuanced tweaks, you know, yeah. okay. So instead of fixing, you know, like losing weight, how about let's focus on getting healthy. Yeah. It's so subtle, yeah. but the languaging yeah. there's processes. Yeah. Um, does that help Didi? Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's sort of turning around. So, so you focus on, on, on the positive outcome. Mm -hmm. instead of uh, thinking about how to get away from what you don't want so mm -hmm. it's it's, yeah, it's a really positive my, message yeah yeah i can give one of my example uh, yes, please. I, I always lived a healthy life i went for a walk i did a lot of yoga uh, but mm -hmm. going to the gym somehow i had a lot of resistance towards it in my life uh, especially my parents and siblings they never even thought of uh, gym um, so now I go to gym every single day and I enjoy mm -hmm. going to gym I enjoy all the exercise so mm -hmm. that is the shift yeah. happen that's awesome mm -hmm. that's so awesome yeah I'm sure you have are there any other stories of transformation you can share without mentioning names like keeping it you know, yes, you know, confidential. Give us some more examples of some of the transformations you've been able to help people with. Um, yes, I have many uh, clients. I also have a lot of testimonial what ha helped them. Um, I can like email it to you later on if you need it. Oh no, I'm uh, just I'm just saying like right now, like I'm thinking. Um, in one of the sessions that I was in. There was mm -hmm. a gal who, like, this is the kind of stuff that a Parajitha does, just to give you guys all an example. Mm -hmm. um, I was in a session with this gal, and she was telling us that um, she just had this fear, this unknown fear of speaking in front of people. Like, she just mm -hmm. couldn't, she just couldn't figure out why every time she went to go, she could speak one-on-one, -on -one, but when she got in a room, a group of people, why was that? Like she could not, she just couldn't mm. get over it. Mm -hmm. And in this process that Aparajita is explaining, it, there, it's, uh, she realized, again, it's a quick unpacking <laughs> process. She realized, oh my gosh, when I was in first grade, 
the teacher had me stand up in, in yeah. class and no, or it was actually it was a whole other thing, but it was something similar to that. So she did yeah. something. Um, she made an honest little mistake. That's right. She locked her teacher out of the building. <laughs> it was an honest <laughs> mistake. And, and so when, when the teacher finally got back in the building, like it was an honest mistake, she didn't mean to do it. She closed the door and then it locked and mm -hmm. the teacher uh, punished her in front of the entire class because of it. Ooh. And because of that, that trauma went inside of her and without even realizing that was happening. And she carried mm -hmm. that with her for years. And mm -hmm. because of the processes that a parajita does, she was able to get to that quickly unpack that. And, um, and then you know, that awareness, just being able to shine that awareness on there. And it's like, Oh, now I can start making better decisions based on that. Yes. It's just powerful. It's, and there's yes, way so more to it than that was a simplified version, but that's the example and the power of the work mm -hmm. that Parajita does. Oh, yeah. so amazing. This is so powerful. Mm -hmm. Great. Yeah. I have many examples of it. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Awesome. So, um, at the end of this podcast, we're going to be sharing her website where all those testimonials are on there, correct? So we'll get to yeah. that in just a bit. Um, but a couple of other questions. Um, so when, when, when you're talking to somebody and they're considering hiring you as their transformational coach, what mm -hmm. are some of the things that, that tend to hold them back from like going all in on themselves and saying, you know what? I'm going to invest in myself with the Parajita and, and uh, create this life that I love. What are some of the objections? Uh, Sometimes what happens that uh, they try to stay safe by means that unconscious does not allow, or some people call it subconscious does not allow to take, let them take the actions that or past beliefs, like uh, self-sabotage beliefs, uh, limiting beliefs. Uh, they live in the past or like in the victim. Victim means that a oh, poor me, uh, I cannot do anything uh, about it or is it going to even help me? Um, or I have followed so many different processes, so many different techniques. So is this going to help me? Is this going to help me where I want to be? And there are some of the examples I can say, they may think that, okay, I'm not worthy or I'm not good enough or I don't belong. I'm insignificant. Um, or I'm not capable, or I'm not perfect. So those all come in the way when they are trying try to take the action. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Go ahead, Giri. Yeah, I was just going to ask, is, is there anything else that might be holding people back? What's your experience? Um, As a single woman or a woman, uh, many mm -hmm. times what happens that when you live in the family, especially from the background where I came, cultural thing, uh, we always ask uh, from the like family's permission. So there is a permission mm -hmm. comes back. Okay, can I do this or um, am I allowed to spend this money? Or sometimes mm -hmm. like if you're living on your own you have other priorities that, okay, I need to take care of the household expenses, mm -hmm. children's expenses, my expenses. Can I spend this money? But yeah. it's a lot more than like, I can tell from my own example, I took money from the credit card. Then I earn a lot more money. Wealth just comes. Earning just comes. And then you get back a lot more than what you spend or invest in yourself. And it's not yeah. just it. Um, in just wealth area, relationship, health, um, I'm like much more healthier right now and much more stronger. Mm -hmm. I started going to gym, so I feel a lot better and very confident. And relationship, I can tell my relationship with my children because of the divorce and whatever happened. In the, it wasn't that great. But since mm -hmm. I started the yeah, Magman training, it shifted. Now my uh, relationship with my children are a lot better. And so and now I you are creating, it. helping your clients create that change in themselves. Yeah. What would you say to a, a single mom or someone listening right now that's really mm -hmm. resonating with your message right now? What would mm -hmm. you say to them to get them over those objections that you just spoke of? Like, what, mm -hmm. can, you, can you speak to that for a moment? Yes. Um, most women, they think that the re having results, having what they want in their life has to be the struggle or it's hard mm -hmm. or it's not possible. 
So if it's possible for me, it's possible for you. That's what I would say. I love it. I love it. Yeah. Excellent. Yeah, it, it, it's, it's like it's like you're you're the great example actually, because you've already done what you're teaching uh, these women to do, and and I really love that. Yeah. It's such powerful work that you that you do. And I personally, so I, I know Aparajita from our trainings and I've seen your you blossom and grow. And my gosh, you went abroad, like you just sold everything and went to another country and like you're doing all these bold moves. It's so fun and so awesome to see that. I'm I'm just so thrilled for you. So I'm very excited to help get this message out to the people that need to hear from you. <laughs> Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah and another exciting thing i have news i'm publishing my book yay awesome. that's, yeah. amazing. Sure that's that's exciting and i'm sure that'll be on your website all the details will be yes. there so yes. why don't you tell us um what would the listeners do next how do they get in touch with you uh, they can go on my uh, website, landing page and sign up or they can uh, first session i give them free session it's called mm. like, yeah, connecting call or discovery call. So they can find out just from one like little process, how much shift they will feel so that I give them that little experience. So they have that trust that, okay, yes, if she can do it, I can do it. It helped me in just a few minutes. It will help me along the way. I love it. And what's that website address? It's www that qlcreator.com okay so that's qlcreator.com and what an amazing gift uh, we would strongly recommend uh, any of you who are resonating with this to go into the website and book this uh, discovery free call with Apojita yes yeah thank you for that free call that's amazing that's wonderful yeah. What, yeah, what is a great way to... Go ahead. Yeah, usually I don't provide free sessions, but just to... Uh, it's my passion. I would love to transform mm -hmm. as many as lives as possible. So first call, I'm giving it for free. And and for someone to be able to experience the work, that's the best. That's the best way yeah. to do it because yeah. otherwise it's... I know, and and Gidi, you can speak to this because you're kind of on the outs. You you've not been in this training, so, um, you know, it it's it's almost too good to be true. How awesome this work is! Yes, and so for you to give that gift of a few minutes of you know your free time, um, that's awesome. So, um, so listeners definitely take her up on that. Um, QLCreator.com, and let's wrap it up, Gidi. Unless you have any other yeah. questions, I think we got them all. No, 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 no. I, I just want to say that it's obvious, uh, you know, the passion that shines through. That's, that's amazing to see. I love it. Yeah. Yeah. So that, thanks thanks for coming on the show today, Parajita. It's yeah, been a pleasure. Yep. <laughs> Likewise. Thank you both. It's been an honor and uh expressing myself i'm like very excited and as well as uh, those all who i am ready to accept my help mm -hmm. ready to transform their life i'm really looking forward to it and i love you all i would really be honored if you choose me as your coach <laughs> yeah we would all of them yeah, we, we would definitely recommend that you go into qlcreator.com and book a call. I'm Kitty. And I'm Awesome Angie. So once again, thank you, Aparajita, for coming on our show, Momentum Maker Podcast. Thank you all listeners for listening. And keep your momentum, keep moving forward. And if you want to learn more about what Gidi and I do with Elite Virtual Stages and how to help scale your business... You can find us on Facebook as well as on the web at www.elitevirtualstages.com forward slash Phil, F-I-L-L, -L, Elite Virtual Stages. That's Gidi and I. And um, once again, thank you, Aparajita, for joining us today yep. and sharing your beautiful you. message. You you are shining in the world. Um, mm -hmm. And again, I've, 
I've known you from the beginning of this work and to see you blossom and the fact that you're giving that to other people uh, through your work. That's so amazing. Mm -hmm. So thank you once again. Yeah, yeah. sure. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you both. <laughs>